Hey guys, today I'm going to explain how to install this Tesla Model 3 or Model Y liquid crystal display multifunctional dashboard. First of all, what you need to do is to disassemble and use the yellow wrench provided by the manufacturer to pry open the protective casing of these wiring lines. See where my fingers are squeezing. Hold the upper part and then pry the threshold strip. The position you are referring to is the door sill weather strip. There is a detachable clip that has a fascinating physical structure. By prying the upper part of the screw with a wrench, the lower part will contract, allowing you to easily remove it. By following the steps you described, you should be able to successfully remove it. During the disassembly process, it is important to be cautious and avoid injuring your hands. To remove the wiring protection casing in the driver's seat, the process is similar to what was done for the passenger seat. However, to ensure better understanding of how I perform the disassembly, I will demonstrate it again. When installing, please be careful not to injure your hands. Also, when removing the casing, avoid using excessive force and apply appropriate pressure gradually. When installing, it's important not to rush. If you can successfully install it yourself, not only will you save money, but you will also feel a great sense of accomplishment. The yellow wrench will be your best assistant for removing the door sill strip and the wiring protection casing. It is designed not to damage your car's paint. If you encounter any parts that cannot be disassembled by hand, you can always use the tool to help you resolve the issue. Adjust the position of the steering wheel to a suitable position. This will make it easier for you to disassemble it. When disassembling this particular area, make sure to twist it back and forth instead of using brute force. Gently wiggle it up, down, left, and right to loosen it. Because this vehicle is the new 2023 model of the Model Y, it may be more difficult to disassemble. To disassemble here, you need to first use your fingers to separate the parts of the connector, then squeeze them together, and finally push outward. Repeat this operation for all connectors, and you will be able to easily disassemble them. Alright, let's proceed with the disassembly of this part. Please be extremely careful during the removal of this component. When you feel the need to apply excessive force during the disassembly, please stop and use a wrench to gently loosen the fasteners. This is because most of the components in the car are secured by clips rather than screws. There is a connected power cable here that needs to be gently unplugged. Since we are about to make the electrical connection, we need to remove the lower panel. Use a wrench to pry open this area so that it will be easier to route the wires and connect them to the dashboard later. 
Retrieve the same model of cables that you saw in the video. Follow the installation process shown in the video step by step to connect the cables. In total, there are two cables to connect because this is the new AMD system version. Pay attention to the way the cables are routed. Show me how you are routing the cables. Retrieve the connecting cables and follow the way you demonstrated in the video for connecting the wires. Pay close attention to the process, as it is crucial. It is also important to note that the process is relatively simple. Actually, there are only a few wires in total. Simply follow the instructions in the video on how to connect them, and it should be a straightforward process. For the final installation step, all you need to do is ensure that the power is connected properly and align the clips in their respective positions. Once done, everything should be ready to go. On the right side of the steering wheel, there is a scroll wheel that allows you to control this dashboard. It can be continuously updated and upgraded along with your system, so you can rest assured. If you enjoyed the installation tutorial video for this product, please consider subscribing and following for more content. Thank you.